hi guys welcome back to my channel it's intentional favor here again and with a vlog yeah guys um this very day i wanted to show you guys what a typical friday used to be in my life used to be because this is actually an old vlog filmed this video two three months ago but i never had time to edit it so i'm finally editing it now and um as you can tell who am i without my god i mean i'm nobody so yeah as always whenever i wake up in the morning i do my devotion i read my bible i pray to my god of course and i commit my day into his hands and he takes over whenever i finish doing that i just head over to the kitchen to prepare myself breakfast and this is my go-to sandwich ham sandwich i just prepare it and most times i usually don't eat before leaving because i leave the house by 7 a.m it's too early for me to eat well except on Sundays when I wake up very hungry I can tell that you too some days you feel that way yeah so some days really like I just eat in the morning but rarely do I eat early in the morning before leaving for work because of the time I leave so I just prepare my um, sandwich wrap it up in a um, foil paper and um, that's it and I usually the day before I usually have my dinner already packed and kept in the fridge so I just bring it out in the morning and then I go ahead and prepare to leave for work. For my mind now, I'm doing baby hair. <laughs> oh my god. This is all I know how to do. I cannot kill myself. In this world, I can't kill myself. Oh. Should I have a drop the hair? I'm not sure I'm ready for that. Duh. It's seven o'clock, seven o'clock and I'm going. I'm done now. This is how I go to work. Sorry the distress of going to work, man. I can't be bothered, guys. So it's seven o'clock. My seven o'clock alarm is going. So I have five more minutes. I leave my house later, seven or five. So this is actually when I'm supposed to leave, but as you can tell. You can spare some minutes, right? So um, that is it. As you can tell, I'm sweating. In case you are wondering, is this really how you go to work? You don't powder your face, you don't do anything and do. Guys, I sweat a lot. I can't be bothered. If I do all of that, then um, I should also be ready to, you know, to clean it before I leave my house. So as you can see. I'm still sweating around here because I just applied the slim on my leg. It's actually complicated. So guys, off to my first train station. Yeah. So it actually takes me approximately 15 minutes. Some days it's more than that, but the least is three, uh, 15 minutes to get to that train station. It's actually foggy this morning. Where is foggy? Can you see the flower? guys that is spring for you spring a beautiful flower i love spring for this one of the reasons i love spring it comes naturally you literally know we are approaching spring or we are already in spring because it comes naturally flowers will begin to blossom oh my gosh yeah so i'll see you guys later when I get to the train station.
So when I get to the third train, yeah, which is the longest journey actually, that is when I bring out my breakfast and I eat my breakfast in the train. Yeah, 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 yeah. You heard me right. I eat my breakfast in the train. I really can't be bothered because most times once I get to work, believe me, many times I forget I had I have breakfast in my bag because once I log in, it's just work, work, work. So I, I make sure that I have it before getting to the office and... It's what it is at the end of the day. Does it need four? Which is it? Yeah, I've never seen one of these before. Really? Yeah. It's actually for <coughs> transport for Greater Manchester. Oh, is it? Yeah. Yeah, I've never seen so, one before. Yeah, but so yeah. all, any bus, any yeah, train. That's fine, love. Yeah. yeah, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. That's where we roll. So this is um eight thirty-seven. Yeah, so this is two nine. Um actually we resume work by half eight. But because I take the train, if I'm to come to work on or before half eight, eight thirty. I'll need to leave my house by 6 instead of 7 and I'll be getting to work instead of to 9 like this I'll be getting to work to 8 that's too early so I explained it to my manager who happened to understand and said it's fine and really it's fine because so many days just like yesterday I finished work around past 6 and work normally should end by um, quarter to five but then for some days I actually finished work very late the last time was around 6 30 I went on a visit and yesterday too went on a visit that lasted for almost two hours and uh, so that's why we are quite flexible because our work is not just straightforward like that so yeah I so get to work and work begins I have a visit later today um, I think not even a visit. I have um, a walk, direct walk, it's called, with some children in their school today. Thank you. Hi, yeah. Um, please, I'm going to um. See that road? Is this the one? Okay, thank you. Hi guys. So I just finished my visit. This is this. We still lasted for two hours because I've got three children I needed to see and do some direct work with. This is something I love about social work. I love when I see the children like allocated to me. And these particular children are so nice, very outspoken, friendly, funny. One of them in particular. Oh my gosh, I love my job. I really do. Oh, so yeah, I'm just here at the bus stop, waiting for the bus and um, heading back to the office. It should take um, about 53 minutes to get, almost one hour, to get back to the office. You know that I get in as a social worker, get a car. Because if I have a car, all this jumping from one bus to the other will not happen. So it turned out that the bus wasn't forthcoming and then I had to check uh, Google map to reroute and then it showed me that the next place to go to is a train station to take a train and oh my gosh guys this day immediately I got to the train station the train came you could see how I'm just like giving a sigh of relief because yes I made it because if I had missed this train I don't know when I would have gotten back to the office and 
I entered the office, did so many paperwork, and here am I heading home because I'm done for the day. Oh, yeah. Done for the day. Come here, I come. So, guys, that is it, too. This is to five. So, I usually have two options either I take the bus to the train station or I walk to the train station. But it depends on the schedule of the next bus. Most times, that bus is never on time. It's never on time. So, all I do is to respect myself and walk to the train station because missing my train won't be funny to extend my getting home by one hour. So guys, I'm back to warrant so I'm walking back home as soon as I can or as fast as I can so that when I get home I'm not sure what to eat but then I'm going to work I have a night shift tonight my other job as a support worker so um, this is what a Friday in my life is like. So, just getting home, change it, and run off. This is to seven, but I'm to resume my night shift by eight. So, um, I need to be as fast as I can, getting home around seven o'clock, and then just Luckily for me today, actually, I'm working at a closer service. Normally, I used to work at a service that takes me 35 to 40 minutes more to get to. Bus services to that place is not good. If I'm to take the bus, I'll be late and I'll have to walk like 20 minutes to the bus station and door. So 20 minutes to the bus station. And still be late, I'll rather just walk for 35 to 14 minutes. So oh, easy. I need a car. I got late in your hands, so you know, but it's naturally that I can't buy a car, but I don't go. I've not gotten my license yet. So it's well. So that is it. See you guys later. So guys, you can see, immediately I got home, the next thing I did was to start cooking. Indomie! <laughs> yeah, noodles was just um, the only option I have, so I had to quickly prepare um, noodles because I don't really have enough time on my side. I still need to take my shower, dress up and leave almost immediately for work. Times like this, I wish I'm a Korean. You know what I mean. <laughs> and I wonder, trying to eat noodles. When Korean movies fool my head, I was watching a lot of Korean series then. One day I decided to dare them. I was watching it actually, <clears throat> and you know they triggered noodles. And I went and cooked noodles and I was trying to eat it the way they eat the noodles. Um, my tongue so held that day. <laughs> oh my god. I'm watching myself. Hey guys, I'm ready to go. Hmm. This is 7.40. It takes me like 15 minutes to get to work, so I need to start going now. I'd have really loved this vlog to continue, but oh my god, you'll be bored. But probably I'll stop it and start tomorrow. 
to show you guys what my Saturday looks like. My weekend, you know, I keep saying it that I look forward to when I'll say, thank God it's Friday. I have never in my life genuinely said, thank God it's Friday. If I've ever put the hashtag or used it anywhere, it's just cliche. If you've not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching up till this moment. Like, share, comment, and I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Until then, stay blessed, remain intentional, and take care of yourselves. Bye.